Are you looking for the best brewer's yeast? I've talked about this stuff before. My wife got it because she was using it for helping with milk production because we just had our baby. And um, I did a video talking about that. And I started adding this to my smoothies because I've been looking more at some of the like nutritional information and protein stuff that goes on with it because I like to try and get as much nutrition into my smoothies as I can. And I didn't even realize what all was in here. And I wanna talk to you guys about that today. First of all, hi. I had all the new dads out there. This is Dad Reviews. This is where I give you my unedited, hopefully more authentic look at the products that I like, use, and have, and well, my wife buys, and then I start liking. So if you're interested in that, you might want to consider clicking that subscribe button. So this is the Solgars Brewer's Yeast. Like I said, I did a little bit of video about it before. If you guys want to check this stuff out, I'm going to link it up down in the description below. Y'all can go and read other people's reviews about it, not just take my word for it. But this is premium, all natural, unflavored, unsweetened, unfortified, nothing added, naturally delicious, suitable for vegetarians. You get 14 ounces of this dietary supplement here. So what I found very interesting is um, I don't eat, I try, I eat some protein. I don't feel like I get enough protein. So I try to add things in my smoothie that will give me pro a lot of extra protein. And, uh, and on the back of this uh, can here, they have typical naturally occurring amino acid profiles per serving. And it's basically a breakdown of all the different types of protein that's in here because in two tablespoons of this stuff, there's 13 grams of protein. And then they break all of that down for you by all of the different amino acid types. So I use an app on my phone called Chronometer. I've mentioned this app before. I want to do a review of it. But um, basically what it does is it you open it up and you can scan barcodes and using the barcode scanner and I guess other people who've put some data entry into this thing, it'll, uh, it'll pull up its nutritional profile. You put in how much you have there, how much you, you're eating, and then you can click on here to see all the nutrients. So uh, somebody has gone in through here and they've told it, you know, you get this many of these vitamins here, you got so many of these minerals here, and then it keeps track of it for you and you can set targets targets for yourself and whenever I went down to the protein I saw that it had all these different amino acid profiles for it and so I was going to compare it to this thing right here to the back of what's on the can here and the app doesn't even have all of the amino acids that this can has in it. There's some things like the L-alanine and the L-arginine, uh, L-aspartic acid. None of that's uh, in here but it's in here which I thought was really great because they're giving you possibly some extra amino acids in this stuff that uh, you usually don't get maybe in most nutritional type stuff. That's what I'm assuming, I'm not sure. I'm just kind of going based off of that chronometer thing because that's um, kind of a guess a baseline for what you need. And if I'm getting a little bit of extra here, I think that that's always a plus. So like I said, if you guys wanna check this stuff out, I'm gonna link it up down in the description below. Let's do a little sniff test though. See what this stuff smells like. I, I, I've used it a few times. Oh, also I, I do say, I need to say that it calls for two tablespoons uh, is the serving size. Whenever I go to make a smoothie, I usually don't put that much. Uh, I don't know why, maybe it's just because I don't want to go through it all. But also I put a bunch of other proteins in there as well. I've got this stuff right here. I'm gonna do a review of it on soon, my protein powder that I use. So make sure to click that subscribe button if you guys want to see that. But um, yeah, I don't use the full two tablespoons in there. Uh, let's see what this stuff smells like. I haven't smelt it yet. Ooh, that's got a strange smell. I can't put, I mean, it is, I guess it's yeast. <laughs> who goes sniffing yeast every day? <laughs> I guess somebody who works in a bread factory maybe. <laughs> yeah, that's got a very interesting smell. I can't, I can't really, it's, it's like bread but like not cooked <laughs> dough, <laughs> but without all the stuff in there. I don't know, That's that has a very funny smell to it. Have you guys ever smelt this stuff before? Have y'all ever used brewer's yeast before? Let me know that down in the comments below. I'd be curious to know. Um, but so far, for a dietary supplement, for smoothies, and apparently for uh, lactation, breast, uh, you know, helping get milk out for your baby from your wife's boobs, um, this is good stuff. This is the stuff we use, Solgar. Like I said, linked up down in the description below. You guys can go and check it out. If you guys want to see some of the other nutritional things that I eat on this channel or that I've tried or that I've talked about, I'll put those right there on the screen. I think you guys are going to enjoy some of those videos, so I'll see you on those videos. 
Thank you dads for watching. Do you guys drink smoothies? Let me know that down in the comments below and let me know what your favorite one is. Thank y'all for watching. That thumbs up is always appreciated and dad out.